Found some. Get in the boat, boy. Don't want me to tie it to the boat? Father? What? Did something change? The forest feels different. Everything is different, boy. Try not to dwell on it. Yes, sir. Where do I see my mother? Oh, there do I see my father. Oh, there do they call to me. Oh, there do they call to me.
She's ready. Sorry. Squeeze. This knife. It was hers. Now it is yours. She taught you to hunt. She knew. Show me. Now? Now. What are we hunting? You are hunting deer. Which way? In the direction of deer. Okay. Uh... This way. Ah! <laughs> Found it! Slow down, boy. Sorry. You are hunting deer, not chasing it. Yes, father. We broke our bridge. How are we gonna get across? Step aside. Wow. Go. Oh, what happened here? There it is! Hold! What are you doing? Now its guard is up! Only fire! Only fire when I tell you to fire. I'm sorry. Do not be sorry. Be better. Find it. <clears throat> Find it. They've never come this close to our woods before. 
keep moving. Up there! You went in the old temple. But Mom told me never to go in there. We do what we please, boy. No excuses. Can I have my bow back now? Can you hit it from here? We should get closer. I went hunting with Mother a bunch of times. She never wanted to take me. Why now? It was her wish. And it was time. Okay. Father. Look. Wait for my mark. Relax. Do not think of it as an animal. It is simply a target. Clear your mind. Exhale and release. I got it. Good. <sighs> it's... Still alive. Your knife. No. Finish what you started. I can't. Boy! Boy! Look at me! We did it. You are not ready. What? Are you serious? I found the deer. I proved myself! How am I not ready? We are going home. I haven't been sick in a long time. I can do this. You are not ready. Inside, boy.
lost control. That thing was trying to kill us. It's not like you don't get anger in a fight. Anger can be a weapon. If you control it, use it. You clearly cannot. When you... I haven't been sick in a long time. I'm better now. Fine. Come on, then. You want me to hit you? I want you to try. Ow! What are you... Try again. Why are you doing that? Too slow. Try again. Cut it out! Weak. Again. Again! Stop it! Again! <coughs> Your anger. You can get lost in it. That ahead is difficult. And you, Atreus, are clearly not ready. Quiet. Come on now. There's no use hiding anymore. I know who you are. What's going on? Do you know him? More importantly, I know what you are. Boy, beneath the floor. Now. But you told me never to go down there. Who is that? I do not know. What's he talking about? I do not know. Get in. Just tell me what I want to know. No need for this to get bloody. Huh. I thought you'd be bigger. You're definitely the one. Long way from home, aren't you? What do you want? Oh, you already know the answer to that. Whatever it is you seek, I do not have it. You should move on. <laughs> and here I thought your kind was supposed to be so enlightened, so much better than us. So much smarter. And yet you hide out here in the woods like a coward. You do not want this fight. Oh. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I do. Leave. My. Bedsons. 
Did I? Slow and old. You should never have come to Midgard. So, care to try again? You talk too much. You won't talk? Fine. Maybe whoever it is you've got stashed in that house will. Your struggle is pointless. It didn't have to be this way. Pathetic! You can't win! I feel nothing! But you, you feel everything, yet you, you keep trying. I'm not my brother. And if you'd given me what I wanted, it wouldn't have ended this way. But no! Let's finish this. <laughs> Can't beat me! 
so much I I thought you're all right I am all right come <clears throat> gather your things we are leaving that I wasn't ready you are not we have no choice now Prove me wrong. Yes, sir. The mountain. been a protection stave around our entire woods. But the stave's broken there. Did you cut those down? She had marked the tree she wish used for her pyre. Why'd she do that? Come. No looking back now. All these dead. You think it's safe in there? You think it's safer out here? Oh! What's that smell? Now! Are they Hellwalkers? They're untouched. Look! Someone start the fires! Sigmund, you're nice. So many days without meat. Meat? Wait, to us? Behind me. What if they change like the others? We'll have to keep them alive. Strip off their meat. A little at a time. This fight is mine alone. You killed me! Father, help me! 
Atreus! Ah! yourself. We must find a way out. Here. Find something to pull me up. Okay. Atreus, the chain. The chain, right. You are in your head, boy. Let it go. He would have killed you. I know, I had to do it. I do know that, I just... And we will go home, boy. What? To give up this easily. So close to the start. Wait, no! I'm not giving up. I can do this. I just have to, you know, catch my breath. Come on up. I'm ready. Listen to me. To be effective in combat, a warrior must not feel for his enemy. The road ahead is long and unforgiving. No place for a boy. You must be a warrior. I understand. Get up and move your ass! Can't get this slow-eyed cock -lump to cross the bridge! Because she's scared of something in the trees over there. There's what now? Father, throw your axe at those trees on the other side of the bridge. The ones with the white <laughs> trunk. You were right. Say, you must be smart or something, boy. You are a boy, aren't you? Does she have a name? I don't know. Rude bastard ain't ever asked mine, so I ain't ever ask hers. Ah! Ha! What's yours? Brock. Get a look at Say, uh, you're not gonna believe me, but that axe you got. It was me what made her. Me and my brother. Was one of our best. 
So don't let nobody else go work on her except for us two. You gotta handle her special, or she'll wreck beyond fixing. I can enhance her for you right now if it so pleases you, son of a bitch. So what say you? You are right. I do not believe you. Come, boy. There's a rune in the shape of a fork under the grip. Oh, digger beat ya, Doomber. Fuck off! That was our brand, my brother and me, before we split. I got half of it right here, see? Look, you want I should upgrade her or not? Very well. I expect an improvement. So, where's the other half of the brand? Oh, my dumb brother's got it. But I got all the talent. Look! Never been this close to the mountain before. Looks so big. I wish Mom was here to see it. I did what you said and it looked like it bounced off. Could the boar be magical? Hmm. What do you think? It looked weirder than any boar I've ever seen. Get after it then. Over speed. Yes! Well, do not lose it. Boy! Boy! Address! What did you do? I'm sorry! Address! We didn't know he belonged to anyone. He doesn't. He's my friend. The boy was following my command. Then help fix this. Hold here, please. Hold, I said. He's losing blood. The last of his kind in all the realm, and you shoot him. You needed food? Target practice. Target practice. I'm... I'm so, so sorry. Keep that pressure on. The blame is mine. I should keep a closer eye. Will he die? I will not let him. You. The arrow cut a tideway inside him. Find both ends and hold them tightly. Start with the left side. Grab it and hold. Now the right side. Hold it good. Now pull them together. Line them up. So now... Fuck. You're a witch. I can't finish. 
finish the healing here. My home is just beyond the trees there. You will carry him. He must not die. Good. He seems stable and calm for now. Grey This way. Quickly. Place him on the stave there. Keep him still. You live alone? It's better this way. Yeah, my father doesn't like people either. Boy. Well, you don't. Hold him still before he hurts himself. Good. Easy. Rest now. I need two more things. Fresh red root grows just behind the house. Can you pull a cluster? What else? I... I know you're a god. Not of this realm, but there's no mistaking it. He doesn't know, does he? About your true nature? Or his own? That is none of your concern. The gods of these realms don't take kindly to outsiders, trust me. I know. When they find you, and they will, they'll make things difficult. The boy will want answers. That will be my problem. Whatever you're hiding, you cannot protect him forever. But you're right. Doesn't concern me. I also need lamb's crest. Do you mind? It's a white petal flower in my garden. Just a handful. Fine. Lamb's Chris. <sighs> Would this help? I dropped it? When you were chasing the animal. What's wrong with me? If I... If I lost it then... You did lose it. I'll take better care of it from now on. Leaving. Wait. Not without thanks. You want solitude? This mark will hide you from those who might make your journey difficult. that leads safely out of these woods. Follow this path down, then head towards daylight. Will we see you again? As much or as little as you like. Now get out of here. Come, boy. I see rooms there, Miss Chess. Can't make it out.
It reads, sacrifice your arms to the center of the water. Awaken again the cradle of the world. What? Throw our weapons into the water? Guess that won't be a problem for you. Are you gonna do it? wasn't there before, see? And there's the mountain. Look it, that building leads from the foot of the mountain to that golden temple. It was all just under the surface. Except for the statue. Good thing, huh? There's even a dock. There, next to the flag. Is this the way to the mountain? It would seem. If it isn't the bearded beaver, it is sack seed. If I got something for you too. Brock? But how did you? None of your fucking business. Now get in here. I got something for you. And don't go making pig eyes at my spot. I saw it first. Okay. What do you think he wants? To test our patience. When word gets out about my new shop, folks will finally come out of hiding. They'll be clawing all over each other just to catch a whiff of my wares. You watch. You rust around like that everywhere? Yeesh. Catch! The pile of rocks there? With that key of Yggdrasil, you can open a magic door to the branches of the World Tree. A shortcut between the realms. If you ever see a mountain in the world, use it to get back to me quick. But it's only one way. Straight back here and nowhere else. And whatever you do, never, never, ever, never, ever throw yourself over the edge of the path. Lest you want death. Yeah. I don't see us wanting that. Whoa. Sure is foggy here. Another dwarf. Should we... No. He is of no consequence. Uh, excuse me, but, um... How did you come by that, uh, axe? That is my concern alone. And, uh, while I won't dispute that, I, I know that blade. It was one of ours, but, uh... <laughs> we didn't make it for you. Step aside. I can't. See, the woman we made it for, I was, uh, well, I am quite fond of her, and I would be somewhat...
displeased if it turns out that... <sighs> you did something to her. It was my mother's. She left it to father before she died. Face dead? I'm very, very sorry to hear that. She was a fierce warrior. And a good woman. Okay. I will make improvements to the axe. But... Nobody asked you to. Well, it's, it's true, but... But knowing your mother... <laughs> She would have insisted I repair that act of vandalism perpetrated against her axe by my brother. I knew it. You are Brock's brother. The other half of the brand's here. The blue one is your brother. Yes. Though my talents are vastly superior. <laughs> no boast. I swear to Freya. <gasps> Do not undo his work. Improve upon it only. Yeah, but can you can you put it down over there? That handle is no. Filthy. Okay then. I'll just. I will just. Oh. 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 Oh, is that dried blood? Oh. So, what were you working on? Oh, that. I call it the Sky Mover. Just up that mountain waits a treasure trove of rare resources. Once I mine it, I'll need a way to bring it all down. And you know how to fix it? Not even a little. Stay back, boy. Ugh. What is that? We must find another way up. The witch! Wish she was here. Bet she could get us past this. My magic is useless against the Black Breath, and there's no way around it. Odin saw to that long ago. What are you doing here? Making sure you can finish your journey. Why wait to warn us? I was busy, saving my friend, if you remember. The Black Breath is a corruption of magic even I can't dispel. Only the pure light of Alfheim is strong enough to break through. But that road is long. What does this goal mean to you? It's everything. Follow me. Why help us? Maybe I see more of myself in you than I'm willing to admit. Maybe. Maybe by helping you, I'll make up for a lifetime of mistakes. Or maybe I just like you. Even though we shot your friend? Even though you shot my friend, yes. Where must we go? To a realm beyond your own. Wait, so did the giants or the elves build tier stuff? All the races held in its construction. It was the last great act of cooperation between the realms before peace disappeared for good. Leotka! Your bowstring stopped glowing. Its power is now depleted. Only a few knocks of magic remained in the bowstring, and we used them. Your bow, please. Once you claim the light of Alfheim, infuse the bowstring with its power. Don't forget. Talk like you're not coming with us. I'll try, but measures were taken to keep me trapped in Midgard. Why? The 
gods don't care for me much. Is this it? It's so dark. This temple has been asleep, underwater for almost 150 winters. It needs only the light of the Bifrost to reawaken. Those roots don't look like your magic. They aren't. These roots are part of the Great World Tree, and make travel between the realms possible. How does it work? You will need this, a Bifrost, to create travel between realms. It can capture, hold, and transfer the light of Alfheim. Place the Bifrost there. What now? Give it a moment. The temple needs time to wake up from its long slumber. It is from this room, and this room alone, that you will be able to cross between realms. What you see before you represents the temple in which we stand, as well as the realm towers that encircle the Lake of Nine outside. All the realms exist in the same physical space, reflections of each other. These doors, the towers outside, and the Nine Realms are all intertwined and coexisting on the branches of the World Tree, separated only by the Bifrost Light of Alfheim. This place can focus and control that light. And is this the World Tree? Only an artistic representation of it. No, the Yggdrasil is much, much more than this. The Tree of Life is bound to the fate of the world, just as we are bound to it. The tree nourishes our soils. The dew from its leaves feeds our valleys and rivers. The tree's very existence supports all of creation along its boughs. Its life energy interwoven into the tapestry of life. Birth, growth, death, and rebirth. Every strand transcending time, transcending space. Everything comes back to the tree. So, that's how it works. But I'm guessing you were looking for a more practical answer. Yes. Very well. The bridge you pushed outside is currently positioned to lead to the realm of Vanaheim. Instead, turn the wheel to our actual destination, Alfheim. Wait, is this moving the big bridge outside? Yes. The wheel turns the bridge, and the bridge aligns to the different realm towers on the lake outside. Wait, there's no tower on this one. And that's why realm travel to Jotunheim is impossible. Without a tower for the bridge to lock into, the sequence can't begin. Every realm has a travel room that unlocks the bridge to that realm. I'm giving you the one for Alfheim. Now you can lock in your destination. We're ready. Remember to take the Bifrost. You don't want to lose that. Now the Realm Travel Bridge will align, and the Realm Between Realms will open. See that giant crystal? Each realm has a corresponding one that focuses and amplifies the power of the Bifrost, opening the bridge to that realm. That's why realm travel is only possible from this room. What about that one realm tower missing from the lake? The Jotunheim Tower disappeared from all realms over a hundred winters ago, when the giants vanished from Midgard. Where the tower went and how they moved it remain a mystery. Follow me. The Bifrost is dark. This trip was its last use. There's no going back until it's replenished with the light of Alfheim. So we are trapped. Someone of your ability should have little trouble getting back to Midgard. And you'll be able to make that black light go away? With the captured light of Alfheim, yes.
Welcome to Alfheim, gentlemen. Think you can spot... The light. I can barely see it. Something's wrong. See that column of light on the horizon? It's housed in the heart of a ring temple. We'll find what we need there. No. No, no, no. Damn it, not yet. What's happening? <sighs> to restore the Bifrost magic, you must step into the light. But be very careful not to get caught. She's not dead. Is she? Not likely. Come. What'd you say? I said nothing. Really? Okay. your mother speak of this realm? Not much. Just that since the elves are always fighting over the light, they kept them isolated. Huh? Again, I said nothing. Weird. Could have sworn you said something. What is it, boy? Voices! You don't hear that? I hear nothing. It's going away now. It was screaming. Lots of voices. Angry. You really didn't hear that? No. It felt... evil. to the light? How do you think we get it into the Bifrost? The witch said to step into it. She did? When she was ripped away from this realm. Oh, how did I miss that? You were more concerned with her safety than our goal. Is... Father! <laughs> Quiet! I have him. Your knife boy. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
Protect our flank. Yes, sir. Done. Enemies ahead. Keep shooting, boy. I will clear our path. Shorten the time between your volleys. A narrow path negates superior numbers. Here. It's the source of all of it. Wait, it's it's singing. I hear. I hear her! I told you I heard her! Do you think she's in there? Ah! Ah! Oh, that really hurt. I felt like my hand was on fire. Stay here. But I want Stay to go. here. Only use it as a last resort. You're giving me your axe? I'm letting you hold my axe. It is not a gift. Still. seem to want to. I'm strong. I'm smart. I'm not what he thinks I am. I know better. He doesn't talk to me. Doesn't teach me. It should have been him. Do you hear me? Him, not you. 
Except... I don't mean that. You know I love him. I just wish he was better. I know he can. So if he tries, I'll try. But if he doesn't, please come back. I know you're out there somewhere. Gone only. Moments. No! You've been gone a long, <coughs> long time. I didn't know what to do. You left me here again. <coughs> Why don't you care? I... That's impossible. We should go before they come back. I hoped you got what you needed. Yes. Look! There's our exit. But there's no light to make a bridge. We're trapped. And the witch's bowstring is useless. Boy, your bow. Hold it out. You wouldn't even care if she was. Mind your tongue, boy! Until our journey is over, one of us must remain focused. Do not mistake my silence for lack of grief. Mourn how you wish. Leave me to my own. I'm sorry. I didn't realize. No. Why would you? You do not know my ways. I know it has not been easy. In the light, I felt only moments pass. If that is of some comfort to you. That's good to know. Really? There's a note. A giant's prayer. They're asking their ancestors to watch over them. To guide them home. Boy. Wait. I think I know how it works. to watch over mother. 
Do you think they'll watch over us on the way to the top? Come, boy. It is a long way up. We're almost at the summit. Nothing's gonna stop us. Calm yourself, boy, and stay behind me. Yes, sir! Enemies ahead! Wait, boy. It's Sindri. Can you kill something that big? If we can catch it off balance. I can distract him. What are you doing? We have to help him. Break right. Find an angle. Wait for my mark. Hey, Oakley! Over here!
Dad! Be ready to lower the crane on my mark! I don't know how this thing works! I do not care! Be ready! Nobody's killed a dragon for hundreds of years. Not since the grand culling of the worms. And unless I'm mistaken, you did all that for me. You are mistaken. The dragon was simply in our path, nothing more. You deny it all you want, but you saved me. And that deserves compensation. What are these? Braided mistletoe arrows. Straighter than Heimdall and perfectly weighted. Oh. Uh, thanks? Oh. Okay. Hold on. Uh, ooh, not that. Um, have you seen my brother again? Yeah. He said you lost your talent. <laughs> oh, and that I'm selfish. No. I'm sure. That I value a weapon's look. No. Over its purpose. That I'm pretentious. No. And I'm tight. Fussy. I know what he thinks, but he can't hurt me any- Ah! Burn that. I do not have time for this. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. I have a better idea. What? I just need a tooth from that dragon. Grab that. Oh, ah, never mind. Oh, so unclean. Oh, so, so unclean. Oh, oh, the smell. Perfect. That should do. Oh, yeah. I am not touching that. Just hold it out. Now, run that along the string of your son's bow. Just humor me. Atreus, your bow. Two passes should do it. Ah, gently, now. Whoa! So close now. Your quiver. Strap broke when we fought the dragon. It's all right. I can hold it. Stop. The broken quiver will slow your draw. Pain we endure. Faulty weaponry we do not will do for now. Good? Good. Hmm. Go. Steady, boy. Mind your footing. Oh, no! 
Voices too, right? Yes. Be silent. Sorry. You know why we're here. That sounds like the same man who came to our house. You said you killed him. Shh. You brought company this time. Must be important if the sons of Thor deign to grace me with their presence. Tell me, you two still tripping over yourselves to impress Daddy? The tattooed man tracks show he now travels with a child. Where would they go next? Why would I know that? You're the smartest man alive, aren't you? Smarter than all the dead ones, too. You help me, I help you. Tell me where they are, and I'll talk to Odin. Your father won't let me go, Balder, and he won't let you kill me. You have nothing to offer me, so take your questions, take your threats, take these two worthless wankers, and... Piss off! When no one's looking, we'll be back for your other eye. Don't you forget, we're everywhere. We really are, aren't we? Ah, the very topic of conversation. A tattooed man traveling with a child. We took their path. Make sure we're alone. But we just saw them leave. Do as I say. He doesn't know what you are. And I would keep it that way. Who are you? Me? I'm the greatest ambassador to the gods, the giants, and all the creatures of the Nine Realms. I know every corner of these lands, every language spoken, every war waged, every deal struck. They call me Mimir, smartest man alive. And I have the answer to your every question. Why does the son of Odin hunt us? Okay, there are a few gaps in my knowledge. But Odin's had me imprisoned here for 109 winters. I'm a clever lad. I can piece it together. Promise. Given time. Nobody there, just like I said. The boy's mother is dead. She wished her. She wanted us to spread her ashes on the highest peak in all the realms. Oh, then you've come to the wrong place, little brother. The highest peak in all the realms is not here in Midgard. It's in Jotunheim, realm of the giants. No! That could not be what she meant. Take a look. This is the last known bridge to Jotunheim in all the realms. See that mountain? Looks like a giant's finger scraping the sky. That's the highest peak in all the realms. No here. Can we just take that bridge? We have a Bifrost. When the giants destroyed all other bridges to their realm, they locked this one up with a secret rune. If it still exists, only a giant would know it. And all of them left Midgard a long time ago. True. But today, the winds of fate have kicked up a strange vortex of coincidence. Fact is, there's only one person alive who can get you where you need to go. And luckily for you, my schedule's wide open. We're going to Jodenheim, right? It's your best and only move from a tactical standpoint. It's the one place the man who cannot be killed won't follow you. What do we do? Yes! First, you need to cut off my head. Wait, what? Odin made sure that no weapon, not even Thor's hammer, could free my body from these bonds. But fortunately, you don't need my body. The trick is, we need to find someone who can reanimate my head using the old magic. Old magic? Mm. There's a witch of the woods. She knows the old ways. And she'll help. She might do worth a try. But if she fails, you will be dead. He tortures me, you know. Every day, brother. Odin himself sees to it personally, and believe me, 
There is no end to his creativity. Every single day. This... This isn't living. Very well. Oh, I can't watch this. Brother. In case you can't resurrect me, there's something you need to know. Boy. The longer you wait to tell him his true nature, the more damage you do. He will resent you, and you may lose him forever. There is much about me I would not have him know. Huh? So you value your privacy more than your son? I'm going to cut off your head now. Fair enough. She is here. It's so good to see you again. I knew you weren't dead. <laughs> Hello. Oh, can you bring a head back to life? Uh, I'm not sure I understand what... Wait. Where did you get those? The arrows. Give them to me. Now. They were a gift. Do as she says, boy. These arrows are dangerous. They're wicked. You find any more, you destroy them, understand? Do you understand? Say it! I understand. If I see them, I'll destroy them. It's all I ask. Forgive me. Please, take my arrows in their place. I have no need for them anymore. What's this about a head? <sighs> Do you have any idea who this is? Did you kill him? At his request. He claimed you could revive him. Me? Are you sure you heard him right? Please? <sighs> Take him to the table. Hey, Mille. It's been a long time since I've practiced the old magic. Hold him there. Let's have a look. Well, thankfully his head hasn't decayed much and his brain is still intact. Nice clean cut. Cutting off his head of all people. I sure hope you know what you're doing. Now, hold his head under the water and don't let go. I mean it. That's enough. It worked! Let me see him. Mamir? You there? Yes. Good. Oh. Hello, Freya. Been a long time. You look well. What I did, I did for them. As far as I'm concerned, death suits you better. I'd bow if I could, Your Majesty. Forgive me. Had I known the Witch in the Woods was Freya herself, I never would have suggested this. Freya? The Goddess Freya? You didn't know either. Sorry. When word gets out that Mimir is free, the wrath of Odin won't be far behind. You are God. Leader of the Vanir, once yes, but no longer. You did not think it important to tell me. Are you really going to lecture me about that? We are leaving, boy. What? Now. You're welcome.
had that statue made in honor of Thor. And seeing as the world serpent absolutely abhors the fat dauber, he was probably sick of looking at it. But doesn't that hurt? Well, he and Thor have a bit of an unpleasant history between them. Or they will, anyway. So I guess waking up to see it was worse than the thought of lumps of solid stone passing through his gullet. You want me to ask him? No. Our only concern is Jotunheim. <laughs> Members me. Why are you? Oh no, that's not right. Eh. Uh, Mokuno Huntunkun. Aho. Eh. Echo no Tunno Funno. the pain of your loss. He will help you. Curious. What is it? Oh, nothing to be concerned about. What is he doing? Making sure we're heading in the right direction. Listen closely now. We need two things to get us into the land of the giants. First, we need to learn the travel rune that opens realm travel to Jotunheim. Second, we need to carve that rune into the special gateway. That one of the peak where we first met you? Correct. Except the giants, in their infinite wisdom, saw to it that no ordinary chisel would do the job. Only the tip of a magical chisel opens that gate. Luckily, I know where it is. And it's not far. He looked kind of mad for a moment there. Now that, he thought I said you were friends of Odin. You'll forgive me. I've never spoken the ancient tongue sober. Wait, look! The water's dropped even further. You can see more of the realm towers and statues. I haven't seen new places to explore along the shore. Where is this chisel? Find me a boat, and we'll go from there. This chisel we seek, what is it? I'm glad you asked, actually. I have just the story for you. <clears throat> there was a giant once named Thamu. A very giant giant. Who, despite his mountainous size, was without question the greatest stonemason this world had ever seen. Proud Thamu hoped to one day pass his vast knowledge onto his son. But young Hrimthur had the heart of a warrior. Perhaps the father had too much fear in him, or the son too little. Either way, a quarrel of theirs spiraled out of control, and the overworked stonemason, bonk, struck his son. Rimthur ran off into the night. Feeling shame and regret, Thamur chased after his son, but in his emotional state soon found himself wandering Midgard, lost and alone. Sadly, he caught the eye of the one person he didn't want to meet alone that night, so far from home. Thor. Thor killed him. Oh no. He fell in the village? Aye. When Thamur fell, he crushed a charming place famed for worshipping the Vanir god Njord. Thor always took credit for planning that one. The truth is, the sweaty ball bag just got lucky. There he is. Find the tip of that chisel. That's the magic we need. Hostiles. Are we gonna fight him?
How are we getting down there? I have a plan. You do? Do not act so surprised. Oh, no offense, brother. But I don't even think Thor with Mjolnir in hand could get through that much ice. Then Thor is a fool. This should be entertaining. Boy. Ready. Wow, that was uh, something that the uh, fight. Here, catch. Well, that was a waste of a perfectly good hour. How were you not seen? There is nowhere here to hide. Oh, that. It's a little trick my people can pull. A special way of not being seen. You can be invisible? More like I can step into the realm between realms. And your mind doesn't understand what it's seeing, so it sees nothing at all. That's how we avoid ever having to actually use the weapons we craft. It, uh, it doesn't seem to work on dragons, though. <laughs> your brother wanted to know if you're getting enough to eat. I guess I could tell him you are. Brock was asking about me? Was there meat on his breath? <laughs> You let him touch this again. Come on, then. So that's how Brock was in the temple right after the water drop. He stepped between realms. Okay, now, shush. I need complete silence for this. There you go. Dig in and push with everything. Yes, sir. How do we get down? We 
jump. Really? Come. Do not panic. Why would I panic? Whoa. I have you. Right, you know that. Well, well, well. Good. We should keep moving. The chisel tip. Give the man credit. He has a talent for destroying things. Remember that head. Never leaves my mind. Hurry, brother. We may get a piece of the chisel and be gone before they even notice. Uh-oh. Yeah. Boy. Surrender. The old father demands it. No. <sighs> Good. This fight is mine, boy. Go! And where do you think you're going? Oh no, brother. The little freak's got a bow. What are we gonna do? <laughs> Small one, don't tell me! Boy's sick, he needs Freya. No! Steady. I'll be all right. There you go, lad. <clears throat> I'm fine, see? Andreas. Come on. You already speak it. Learning to read won't be that hard. I know how to read, boy. Just not this tongue. You're halfway there already, then. Okay, so the runes represent a lot of different things. Some gods, some animals... Wait. Some... Oh, am I going too fast? Sorry, Not I'll... that. Do you smell something? Yeah, I do. It smells like... Rain? You ruined everything! I earned that fucking hammer! But now, everyone's gonna think I only got it, cause Magni's gone! It'll be a joke! But if I kill you, no one's gonna laugh at me! Oh, are you dumb? Is that your father's doing? Or did you get it from your mum? 
She's stupid and ugly. Shut up! That's true, but I'm gonna get to know you really well. You're gonna be my new brother, right after I finish killing your father! Stop it! Ah! Whoops! I think I broke him. <laughs> You have to get into Freya quickly. There's no other way. Freya! Open the door! We need your help! Woman, do you hear me? It is urgent! I'm still a god! Go away! The boy has fallen ill! Freya! Inside. This is no ordinary illness. The boy's true nature, your true nature, fights within him. I did this to him. Will you help me? Of course. There is a rare ingredient found only in Helheim. The keeper that protects the Bridge of the Damned. I need its heart. Mm -hmm. Hell. The Realm of the Dead. Do you know it? Not this one. It is a land of unyielding gold. Fires cannot burn there, and no magic in all the Nine Realms can create a blaze. As for the dead, your Frost Axe will be useless. You'll need to find something else. Then I must return home. Dig up a past I swore would stay buried. Who you were before doesn't matter. This boy is not your past, he is your son. And he needs his father. This rune opens the bridge to Helheim. When you are there, do not under any circumstances cross the Bridge of the Damned. There is no road back. Understand? Boy. Himmel. Hey, you must hurry. Through my garden, there's a path leading to my boat. Take it. Return home. Dig up your past. Do whatever you need to do. Just bring me back the Bridge Keeper's heart. And your son may survive. Last we spoke, I was... No. You were right to distrust the word of a god. No need to explain. Not to me, not for that. I will keep him safe. That's a mother's promise. Helheim of all places. You all right, brother? I will do what I must. Leave me be. As you wish.
is nowhere you can hide, Spartan. Put as much distance between you and the truth as you want. It changes nothing. Pretend to be everything you are not. Teacher. Husband. Father. But there is one unavoidable truth you will never escape. <laughs> you cannot change. You will always be a monster. I know. But I am your monster no longer. Foreign magic. Sweet Nana's nethers. What are those? I've never seen the like. That's gotta be a family heirloom. No. Nor will it ever be. Son, my brother and me created me all near for the big idiot. I know from quality. And them, them special. Hey, where's the little turd? He has fallen ill. No. What happened? Aesir? No. The fault is mine. And my responsibility to make it right. No. We all gotta take responsibility sometime. Huh? Say, what can I do to help him? I can do things. And what I should tag along? No. Your work here is enough. All right. The Bridge of the Damned. And there's the Keeper, making sure the dead are really dead. What is that he holds? That totem contains a powerful source of magical energy, the very power of Helheim itself. But what you want is his heart. Just take it and we can leave. How? Start some trouble. You can do that, right? <laughs> Now the heart, brother. You'll have to get your hands dirty. Set. Better not to linger here, though, eh? Kratos. Zeus. Zeus? My father. Your father was Zeus? Well, that explains a lot. What is that place? Never go there. Understand? Ah. 
How is he here? That is not possible. It's just an illusion. Hell's known for torturing its inhabitants with their own past. We should focus on getting back to your son. The heart. You have it. Yes. Back of your hand. He is still ill. I can break the fever, but to heal... He must know the truth of what he is. Yes. It is not so simple. Help me prop him up. Did I tell you that I have a son, too? It's been... forever since I last saw him. At his birth, the runes foretold a needless death. The babe in my arms was so... small. So helpless. I knew right then I would do anything to protect him. No matter the sacrifice. Of course, everything I did, I did for myself. I let my needs, my fears, come before what he needed. And I couldn't see his resentment until it was too late. Don't make the same mistake. Have faith in him. I know the truth isn't simple, but nothing is when it involves your child. It is a curse. The boy has been cursed. Don't leave without me. I will not. I'm better now. I see that. Is he well enough to travel? For now. They won't happen again. I promise. You see that it does not. Get in. I will pull. You are quiet. Are you not better? I guess. I know you overheard my talk with Freya. You think you understand, but you do not. Why do you say nothing? You said I was cursed. You think I'm weak because I'm not like you. I know I was never what you wanted. But after all this, I thought maybe things were different. You do not know everything, boy. No. But at least I know the truth now. The truth? truth. I am a god, boy. From another land far from here. When I came to these shores, I chose to live as a man. But the truth is, I was born a god. And so were you. Boy. 
nothing to say. Um... Can I... turn into an animal? Can you turn into an animal? No. No, I do not think so. She was a god too? No. She was mortal, but she knew my true nature. I'm a god. Why did you wait so long to tell me? I had hoped to spare you. Being a god, it can be a lifetime of anguish and tragedy. That is the curse. Hmm. What sorts of things can I do? Can I fly? Or turn invisible? I don't feel like God. I do not know the reach of your godhood. But over time, you will learn. I can't turn into a wolf. You are welcome to surprise me. Look, boy! Right! The middle! How do I get them in order? Two left. The left! Middle bar! Middle bar! Pull the right! Moon, big dark sun. Middle, quickly! Right! Middle bar! Right! Get it! Well, oh, I can't drown. Yes, that's something. saved you. That was cunning, boy. Boy. Yeah. On the day you were born, I made two knives, mixing metals from my home and from this land. One for myself, and when you were ready, one for you. Today is that day. So I'm a man now, like you? No. We are not men. We are more than that. The responsibility is far greater. 
And you must be better than me. Understand? Say it. Or you will be better. The power of this weapon, any weapon, comes from here. But only when tempered by this, by the discipline, the self-control of the one who wields it. That is where the true strength of a warrior lies. You must never forget that. Good then. Come. close to the end. End. Really? It smells like rotten eggs. Is it still good? Possibly. Father, why did you leave your home and come here? Does it have to do with the other gods there? Hmm. It's just, you hate the gods so much. But Tyr proves that gods can be good. And you're good. You only killed those deserving, right? Yes. Ah. Uh. But who's worthy enough to judge? Quiet, Head. We are. We know better. Uh huh. Sounding more like your da by the moment. Ready. Ready. Come. I think I'm gonna like being a god. Excited to finally see the land of the giants? Yeah, but also sad the journey's almost over. Oh, what if we get to Jotunheim and there aren't any giants there either? Makes little difference to us. Fulfilling your mother's wish is what is important. Ah! Oh, don't go anywhere. Be with you in two shakes. Father, can I tell him? No. Tell me what? Did you put this wheel in your mouth? Oh, God. I I'll vomit. I I'm not kidding. I'll throw up on it. It is nothing. A family matter. Oh. Uh, 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 oh. 
I can tell you a thing or two about family matters. Oh, mm -hmm. oh. Let me guess. Your brother isn't as talented as you, and his work is junk. Um, those things are accurate. Your point? It's all you ever talk about, over and over. Do something about it or shut up already. I see. Yeah! We're sick of hearing about little people's little problems! Um... Alright. That hurt a little. Let's have a look at your gear then. Why did you speak to the dwarf like that? Aren't you sick of hearing about him and his brother? Of course. But it serves nothing to make an enemy of him. You should know the truth, even if it hurts. It was needless and unkind. The truth is more important than kindness. Your mother would disagree. She wasn't a god. Thor! Blame me! Me! For what you did to Magni. My old father called me a coward. Looks like he did more than that. Move it. Or we'll pick up where he left off. I'll kill you. No. He is beaten. Not worth killing. He should pay for what he said about Mother. I said no. But we're gods. We can do whatever we want. <laughs> That's what I said to your mother right before I gave it to her. What are you doing? This is a much better knife than Mother's. You killed against my wishes. You lost control. Haven't you been teaching me to kill? I have been teaching you to survive. We are gods, boy. And that makes us a target. From now until the end of days, you are marked. So I teach you to kill, yes. But in defense of yourself, never as an indulgence. Nobody cared about him anyways. What's the difference? There are consequences to killing a god! Why? How do you know? How do you know? Watch your tone, boy. Whatever. Beautiful, isn't it? Why well, remember once? Bother, look out! <laughs> Miss me. <laughs> Instead, I'll do whatever you Shut up! All uh, this time, I thought uh, I needed you! Uh, but you're just me. Uh, uh, Turns out, the boy is the brains. Uh, 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 Too 
stupid son of a bitch. Get out of here, boy. Yes, by all means, Junior, run away. Let Daddy do all the heavy lifting for you. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Let go! Calm down, boy. You are not ready for this. I am oh! ready. <laughs> and here I thought my family was fucked up. <laughs> oh, your father is right, boy. You are far from ready. Now would you be so kind as to hold this for me? Thank you. Atreus! Give up! Crashing down on you. <laughs> it's over. Is it? So be it. No! Listen to me! Go of it now, or I will kill him. You know I will. What did you do?
Stay still. You will listen to me and not speak a word. I am your father, and you, boy, are not yourself. You are too quick to temper. You are rash, insubordinate, and out of control. This will not stand. You will honor your mother and abandon this path you have chosen. It is not too late. This discussion is far from over. We are here because of you, boy. Never forget that. No. No, I would never stay out of sight. Listen. You, you had no right. I had every right. I am your mother. You had no right, Rich. I can't taste. I can't smell. I can't even feel the temperature of this, this room. Feasting, drinking, women. It's all gone. But you will never God. have to feel pain again. Death has no power over you now. You would rather die? Than never feel again? Yes. Take it away, Mother. I can't. Please. Please. Please take it away. It doesn't work like that. Son. Trust me in time. You will fuck me. You will fuck me. Come on. What you did to me. What you did to me! Freya is his mother. Why did you keep this from us, Head? Would you believe it slipped my mind? I would not. Uh, I'm at a loss. I assure you have no reason to keep such a thing a secret. There's the boat. We will speak more of this. Soon.
with your plan? You're both cracked! We are leaving this realm. Now! As long as we didn't wreck our way back. Look at that! It's the missing panel about here! Odin must have stolen it. But why? He always has his reasons. Might I have a look? Well, this is most unexpected. Why? What does it mean? I haven't the foggiest. Isn't that unexpected? Good. Look, clearly that's Tyr. Traveling somehow. Perhaps magically. But what's that to do with the giants that they should devote a shrine to it? I'm afraid that is none too clear. What are those runes in the corners? Not runes. Symbols from different lands. They mean... War. Aye. How do you... This one I know too well. Oh. His eyes. They are jewels. Like yours. No doubt signifying the gift of sight the giants granted us. Give me a closer look. Interesting. Very interesting. What is that? Secret plans concealed by Tyr so none could access but him. And those few others the giants trusted. And right under Odin's nose, ho ho ho! I did promise I'd get you to Jotunheim. What do you mean, Head? You said we were out of options. Don't you see, brother? Odin never gave up hope, and neither should we. He knew there was a clue in here, but we're the ones who found it. These plans are for a key to some chamber tears kept hidden. I don't know where it's leading or what we'll find, but it's a path. How do we make this key? I suggest we ask a dwarf. Can you make it? Is it a weapon? Armor? Or likewise an instrument of war, of which I'm a master at shaping? No? Then forget it. Even if I wanted to make such an insignificant goo-gaw, I'm liable to chink my tools working on something so delicate and ladylike. Then shingle it. How to weld the item with scaps like. Keep the layers thin. Alternate the overlay. Okay, smart guy. And where do you propose to find a lump of quality scap slag? Last time I saw one, I could still get rigid down south. Shut your mouth, is that... Where did you... I had to get my hands dirty. <laughs> <laughs> well, don't just stand there. Let's do this. What? You? You're fine with working on something that's not a weapon? Well, oh, hell, why not? <laughs> what? I can grow too. Oh, watch, watch the spine. Keep your wrist loose. No, you keep your wrist loose. Yeah, I need more heat here. Coming up. You gonna temper that steel longer? I don't need to. I triple quenched it with Dragor. See, how inventive and sanitary. You clever little beaver. Never too late to learn a new trick, is it? <laughs> no, it's not. Yeah. Here it is. Nope! Don't forget this. Quit your grinning. It's downright unsettling. <laughs> it's just nice to see you together. But now the rune on your brand looks different. Yeah, price of uh, reforging something what broke. I knew it. You two love each other. Oh, cut it out, Francis. You're gonna get me all weak. I like the new one better. Don't you? We have work to do. Oh, 
Roy, your knife. Well, what have we got? Some sort of travel stone. Let me see. Great are Dumbless others. That's the Unity Stone. You know it. I wasn't sure it existed. If Tyr possessed this, that explains how he could visit all the realms and other lands to boot. He held this. In the panel in Owen's library. Yes. Yes, that's it. I understand now. It shows Tyr walking the realm between realms. You know how you must never stray from the path. Well, Tyr always followed his own path, if you catch my meaning. The realm between realms. This is where Tyr stepped beyond, and the Unity Stone protected him. Ready? Ready. Well, if this is it, lads. It's been an honor. Our faith head. This is incredible! That rock can be a thing! Oh, how can I be so nauseous without a stomach? Come on. That was great. Look. The tower. I knew there was something down here. Amazing. How do you hide something that exists in all realms? Cast it out of any realm to the space between. Clever old tear. Is Jotunheim on the other side? Can't be that. It's not like you go through Vanaheim to reach the Midgard peak. But how do we use it? I'd suggest we look inside, but stay alert. Tyr's little challenges are never as simple as they appear. I have noticed. Look! We're back in Midgard! There's the bridge! We did it! The tower's back where it belongs! Now Tyr's travel room can take us to Jotunheim. How did Tyr do this? Odin suspected the giant secretly possessed some remnant of primordial Jotnar creative essence, the stuff all realms are made of. The Unity Stone must have been fashioned from that essence. Wait a minute. This isn't going to work. What? There's no travel crystal. Tyr must have used his own eyes to refract the energy. It was his final failsafe. Who's got eyes like him, Mimir? I've got an eye. One! Odin plucked out my other eye precisely to keep me from traveling. Sorry, lads. Thought that would work. What did Odin do with your other eye? He'd have kept it. In any of a hundred places, I'm afraid. We've come so far. There has to be a way. Look, bit of a long shot. For years, I had these syndrae, sometimes Brock, lurking around in that mountain when Odin came for his visits. Maybe they know something. Brock and Sindri! Hey guys, question for you. Anyone know where we can find Mimir's other eye? Oh. <laughs> That's... <laughs> I'm sorry. As a matter of fact, Odin asked me to... <laughs> He wanted me to build a... He showed it to me, you see, and I... The coin! Sorry, will you excuse me? Well, that was useless. You know, it was about that same time that Odin came around looking for me to build a statue with some sort of hidden compartment. 
Now, that not being a weapon and the ace here being a bunch of pox speckled cockers, I too saw fit to decline. But I know we got it built just the same. What was the statue? It's that one of Thor out there flashing his sack to the lake. The statue that the serpent ate. Sorry about that. Feeling much better. How are we supposed to look inside the snake? Inside? Oh no! <laughs> We'd better go see what the world serpent has to say about that. <sighs> It might still be in his stomach. Um, and he's open to letting you go into his mouth to look inside. Ew. Really? By the by, he's not wild about it either. <sighs> yep, that's an eye. Maybe you should stick that in my head, for safekeeping. Gently now, gently. Thank you, brother. You don't miss depth until it's gone. What's happened here? We hoped you would know. You are far from home. I'm looking for my son. The two of you... You helped me see things more clearly. You do not know where he is then? No. But the woods and fields speak his name. I know he walks here in Midgard. When did you see him last? Long ago, before you were even born. Why are you standing so far from me? What's wrong? Something's happened. There! I had a feeling that hurting the big snake would Bring the two of you out in the open. Do you have any idea, any idea at all, what you have cost me? My boy. Mother. 
I'm here. Don't run away. Oh, I'm not going anywhere, Mother. I know that you're still angry. I know that how you feel hasn't changed, but I, I want you... How, how I feel? How I feel? <laughs> I've spent the last 100 years dreaming of this moment. I've rehearsed everything I ever wanted to say to you, every word, to make you understand exactly what you stole from me. But now, I realize I don't need you to understand anything. I don't need you at all. No, back off, Kratos. This has nothing to do. This path you walk, vengeance. You will find no peace. I know. You. I'll deal with you later. But family first. <clears throat> this again? Turn away, boy. This won't be pretty. I won't let you hurt him. No, boy. Fine. Stop! No! no! Atreus! You're bleeding. Breathe, boy. Breathe! Not my blood. <clears throat> What is that? <laughs> I can feel this. Oh. Oh. I can feel everything. Oh, no! <laughs> He's vulnerable now? Coming back now. Now he remembers. She's controlling that thing? Stay out of it! I can reason with him! No, woman! You cannot! He means to kill you!
I feel! I feel! Freezing! Stop burning my boy! Even the All-Father himself could not. I've never felt more alive! Uh, ironic, isn't it? What? No! What? Do it! <laughs> 
this! Do it! Stop! Please! He's beaten, Father. Not a threat. You will not come to us again. You will not touch her. I don't need your protection. Stop interfering in my life! I was just trying to protect you! I wa <sighs> I've made mistakes, I know. But you're free now. You have what you want. Try to find forgiveness. We can build something new. <sighs> We can. Because I will never forgive. You still need to pay for the lifetime that you stole from me. I have paid. I have paid. But if that alone will make you a whole. If seeing me dead will make things right, I won't stop you. I know. imaginable upon you. I will parade your cold body from every corner of every realm and feed your soul to the vilest filth in hell. That is my promise. He saved your life. He robbed me of everything. <laughs> everything. Just an animal. Passing on your cruelty and rage, you will never change. And you do not know me. I know enough. Does he? Boy. Listen close. I'm from a land called Sparta. I made a deal with the god that cost me my soul. I killed many who were deserving. 
and many who were not. I killed my father. That was your father in hell. Is this what it is to be a god? Is this how it always ends? Sons killing their mothers? Their fathers? No. We will be the gods we choose to be. Not those who have been. Who I was is not who you be. We must be better. Well, guess we are the bad guys now. In her eyes, yes. But she could never make that choice. this journey while I still have strength. Boy, go ahead. Get ready. Oh, right. Got him. Let's hope this doesn't cause you to explode or anything. Oh, haven't considered that. Maybe we should talk about this a bit more. Nah, I'm sure you'll be fine. Ready? Oh, that's unpleasant! Now, boy! A word, please, before we continue. Listen, the last thing you two need up there is a decomposing the heat ruin in the moment. Why don't I wait for you here? This is between you and the boy. True. But if someone were to fight... My lady sifts soft, perfect sloshers. You done did it. Sorry. We had to see this. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Fine, damn it. Fine. Watch the head till we return. I can do this. No, no, I can't. Oh. Okay. Ready. fingers. I can see the highest peak ahead. Right over there. We did it. We did.
What are you doing? I have nothing more to hide. It's nothing. I just thought I'd hear voices by now. Hello? Anybody here? the guardian. I should feel them, but I don't. This place is dead. What happened to them? Why'd mom send us here? One question is answered and two more take its place. a bunch of giants. She... knew giants? That's us! The first time we met the world serpent. But how? And our fight with Balder! But that just happened. Wait. They knew everything that was going to happen. The dragon in the mountain. The stone mason. All these drawings. This is our story. No. This is your story. But... What does it all mean? That I was not the only parent with secrets. She was a giant. I'm a giant. Why didn't she tell us? She sent us here knowing we would find this. But why not just tell us the truth? Mother would have had good reasons. Balder was never sent to find me. He was tracking her all along, not knowing she was only ashes. If she had a plan for us, I trust it. Whatever it is. Besides, she hasn't been wrong yet. Come on. We're so close to the end now. Yes. Yes, we are.
Look, it's Mother's. She was here. She saw every step we took before we took it. Like she was always with us. Watching over us, leading us home. Let's finish it. There's nothing for us here. Come. So, I get that mother was a giant, which makes me part giant and part god. And part mortal. Right. I guess there's just one thing I don't understand. My name on the wall. Giants called me... Loki? Loki? That's the name your mother wanted for you when you were born. She must have called you that to her people. But why? A question for another day. Let us go home. she know it was going to be like this here? Is this what she wanted us to see? Did she want us to tell the people or keep the secret? I do not know. So what should we do? I trust you to decide that. Oh. So why do you want to name me Atreus? I know it can't be for a god. <laughs> no. He was a soldier. A Spartan. A great warrior? All Spartans are great warriors. We train from birth. Our lives were discipline, duty, battle, and death. Life was grim, and we greeted it grimly. Mm. But Atreus of Sparta was unlike the rest of us. He wore a smile even in the worst of times. He was happy. He inspired us to hope that though we were machines of war, yet there was humanity in us goodness. When the day came for him to lay down his life in battle, his sacrifice saved countless others and turned the tide in our favor. I carried him home on his shield and buried him with all the honors of Spartan custom. His memory was a comfort in dark times. Wow! You actually told a good story. 
Umir missed it. I understand if you want to go home, but maybe helping people is part of why mom sent us out here, too. I mean, what would Atreus of Sparta do? And what would Loki do? Huh. That's a weird name. I'm glad we went with yours. Lads, am I glad to see you. I believe I've reached my limit for dwarven charm. What happened, Mimir? They took an uncomfortable number of measurements and then proceeded to bicker about the weather. Where do you want us to take you? How about the warm confines of anywhere bloody else? Time to rest. I'm gonna sleep through winter. Okay, this'll do. Sleep. Way ahead of you. What was that? The ball! Come in. I have me. You would not find me good company. No. I'm sure we'll find lots to talk about. Could have told me before I poured. Why are you here? Uh, just uh, being polite. <laughs> you seem like a calm and reasonable person. Reasonable person. 
If the moment calls for calm. I'd say the moment calls for calm. <laughs> yeah. You know who I am? Back before winter set in, there were some misunderstandings. Regrettable ones. But I think we all have a better idea of who we're dealing with. Now, what you did to his boys. Self-defense. Dying is what we Aesir live for. And let's be honest, they were kind of useless. But Balder, he had value. He was my best tracker, my closer. Yeah, his mind was gone, sure. But he had his uses, and now he's gone because of you. You follow me? You have a debt. And you're no fun anymore. What do you want? How about peace? How does peace strike the esteemed, retired god of war? How about we just don't kill each other? How about you stay home, kick up your feet, seek no quarrel with me, and I'll have none with you? Of course, it means that that one, that one has to stop his search for tear. Yeah, we know what you've been up to. Stop it. Tears old ways are dead. He is dead. You understand? And then that's it. Then we're square. Shit, I'll even sweeten the deal. I'll let you keep the prisoner that I know you stole. <laughs> that's right. I know you're in here somewhere, you silver-tongued little shit. Why should we believe a word of you? What of your promises ever been worth? There he is, my old partner in crime. He's lost weight. If he tells you snow is white, he's lying. What kind of wisdom is that? Can't the smartest head alive see past himself? See that we all want the same thing? All right. Here's a deal I know you can trust. I'll settle your debt with my ex. Keep Freya off your back. Keep your boy safe. That's really all you want, isn't it? So what do you say? Don't take all day.
Now show me this god killer I've heard so much about. You insult me holding back like this. The ghost of Sparta thing! Yeah! It's no what I'm capable of! Show me! Now we gotta fight! Look at you, trying to remember your old moves! How were you ever a god If you're not fighting dirty, you're not fighting, right? Let me see the monster inside! Was it luck? Did my son die? Oh. Blind fucking luck! Oh. Oh, dumbass! Oh. You think you can come here, become a daddy, get a clean slate? That ain't how it works. You're a destroyer, like me. Oh no. I say when we're done. I'm not leaving till I see the real you. Get up! I did not seek that fight with your brother. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> I want to see. 
be the god of war! That's all? We're finally showing you! This is the god that murdered a pantheon because they hurt his feelings? I see why my sons fell to you. Even this lesser version of you. But I am not my sons. And your boy, Allfather, has plans for him. Consider your blood debt paid. It's in you. Told you he'd make it. Kratos, it's Sindri and Brock. That was quite a fight. Can we? Oh, now! Odin is with Atreus. 